Hello. I'm going to teach you how to stack. Part one. What you are going to need is a stack of cups. Go to speedstacks.com. There will be a shop where you can pick up cups online and you can click a button and order them. And yeah. If you want really good ones, you can get Pro Series. If you want normal ones, which I started out with, you should get the Snap Tops. There will be a bunch of Snap Top ones, and that's good. So, once you have that all out, you're going to need a Stack Mat. A Stack Mat is another thing that you can pick up. It comes with this nice surface. And... A timer. Now that you have this out on a smooth surface, a table is best. Floor is like, you probably shouldn't do it on the floor. You should do it on the table. A table. What you're going to want to do with your stack mat is you're going to want to turn it on. It should show some digits. You're going to, you'll notice that there are holes right here. You just want these bumps right here. You want to Put it on and just slide it so it's perfectly aligned and there's none of like this bump right here. After that, I'm going to show you how to start the timer. If you put both hands on it, you'll notice it'll go red and then green. Once it hits green, you can let your hands go. The timer will start. And you stop it by returning both hands to it. And that will be your time. If you want to start it again, notice how it's not getting green here. That's because there's still a time. You need to press the restart button. And then you can do your times. So now take your sack of cups and take three. Just three cups. I'm going to teach you how to move stack at three. So, most left-handers will pick up the first cup with their left. Most right will pick up the first cup with their right. Whatever feel com feels comfortable to you. So, what I'm going to do, since I'm right-handed, is I'm going to pick up one cup with my right hand. Then pick up the other cup with your left hand. Set it down like that. And now put all your cups back in. Now do that again. All right, now I'm going to teach you how to take it down. Pretty much it's the same way. You take the top one with the whatever hand feels comfortable. Most right-handers will use right hand. Most left-handers will use left hand. And then you pick up the other one with the other hand, and you just set it back. Now just try doing that until you get really used to it. You don't get fast by slamming your cups. You get your fast by making your moves with your hands swift and fast. So once you're able to do that, that's good. If you're cups are falling over, try going a little bit slower. Alright, now I'm ready to teach you the 3-3-3 three, three, three stack. Take three sets of three and put them on your mat, all in a line. Now you're going to want to, so, uh, when you stack, you have to start on one end, and go to the other, and then go back to this end for the down stack, which is this. So you can't do this. So you need to start on one end. You can't start in the middle and progress to the other. So if you're good with that, Let's start. So what you're going to want to do, put your hands on the timer until it's green. Let go. 
then move to the first cup. Stack it up. Second cup. Stack it up. Third cup. Stack it up. Then go back to where you started. Like if you went right to left, go back to right. Or if you went left to right, go back to left. Then take each cup down. Then return your hands to the timer. You will see your time. It'll probably be ridiculously slow because one, you just started, and two, this is a tutorial. So try that. Most right handers, PS, will go left to right. Most left handers will go right to left. I'm weird. I'm a right hander, but I like to go right to left. Actually, a lot of people I've taught have actually preferred right to left, even though they're right handed. So that's. Yeah. So try doing that a couple times. Try to get really good time. Once you've gotten nice and fast at it, I'm going to teach you a little trick. So, many people, the traditional way to start your timer is actually like this or like this. But that makes it slower to get to the cups. So, I recommend actually putting your hands like this and making it. You cannot touch the cups when you start. You cannot start when you're touching the cups. You have to start and then touch the cups. When you end, you cannot be holding the cups. You cannot. While you're holding the timer and this, you're still holding. You need to let go. So that's how the 333 works. Part one of stacking. Thank you.